Good afternoon, everybody. This is the brief word for today. Let me talk to you about promises, how promises work. God, yes, the Bible says that all the promises of God are yes and amen, right? But they must be, first be a promise from God. And secondly, we must wait for God to start that promise in our lives. There are some that are trying to kickstart. You're getting the proverbial um battery cables out and trying to connect you with someone or something else to bring to life something that you think God has promised you. That doesn't work that way. The Lord wants to remind you is that he's the one that causes it to start, to come alive. He is the alpha and the omega, the beginning of the and the end in all things. He holds everything together. And so we must grow greater to the capacity of how God works and react to him. Instead of going out trying to see if it is God, react to the things that are already going on. Stop being the kind of person that doesn't know what's happening in your life concerning God's leading and just respond day by day, one step at a time, with the things that God is actually doing in your life. Is God spent telling you to spend more time sitting, reading his word? React to that because that's where God is. If God is telling you to go somewhere and do something through the leading of his word, not your emotions, go do that. But stop trying to go look for things that God wants you to do. It'll just set up for failure hope deferred. You'll be disappointed and the enemy will win in your life.